Hello and welcome to Middle Age Geek Girl. I'm Sally. Today I have four diamond painting kits that were kindly sent to me by DIY Digital Art. So a big thank you to them. So there's three 30 by 30s and one 30 by 40 in this mix. So let's check out what I got. So we'll start with the 30 by 40. So let's first of all check out the kit and there is your standard tool kit. And uh, unusually we got the drills in this bag. Now these bags are still good, the silver stripe bags. I've never had a problem with the drills in them. It's still better than those tiny little packets that were happening. The only thing is you need to kit up if you're going to use these type of drills. But I can also get these out to show you uh, because they're a lot easier to uh, show on camera than the individual bags. And let's just check out the image. And here it is. So it is a teacup with flowers and there's 21 colours included and large lot of uh, the last colour, which of course is the white colour. I mean, there's honestly not that much of a background issue on this one. There's large chunks of it there and there, but I could fill that up quite easily with floral origami paper if I don't want to do the white. But as I said, there's not so vast that I, I might do it. I don't know. <laughs> it really depends on my mood at the time I do these actual kits. But yeah, this is really pretty. Absolutely love it looks like a nice color range which we will check out uh, again sticky not a drama with the glue and I'll bring you down so you can check out how clear the drill field is and yeah printed nicely it's just the same issue I think I've said in numerous videos where they use white ink I if I show it on camera that would help wouldn't it um, if they use the white ink I wish they'd use just a slightly brighter white ink so you can see it with the naked eye but I will use a light pad like I usually do when doing this but there's a little bit of 310 not a lot more it looks like it's in the shadow parts so yeah really really nice color range really printed nicely so I'll cover it up and we'll have a look at the drills in this case so 21 colors there is bag 21 which of course is all of your white ones so a few bags of them. All of the other numbers, 1 to 20, are there. So let's check them out. And really sort of vintage colours. I, I guess they almost look like vintage flowers in that teapot. And you've got some nice colours. More subtle earthy tones in this one. And they all look like they're manufactured really well. Well, that's a nice dark purple. I like that one. Yeah, so really happy with this one. And I think that is going to look really great when done. So like vintage, reminds me of old fashioned colors. Alrighty, so the next three are all 30 by 30. And again, you have your standard toolkit and the drills like so. So we will check out these ones. And here is the kit. I can probably bring you down a little bit closer being that's only 30 by 30. So in this gorgeous image, you've got 23 colors. Again, white background that I may end up doing because it's not as much of it as I thought and you could also just cut off the corners if you needed to with uh, origami paper but this is a really again pretty image nicely detailed 
nicely printed and of course sticky. So again you've got all of these nice vintage colors. Oh sorry if I keep that still for a bit. Again you've got like nice almost vintage subtle colors. They're not bright in your face type colors um, and it's yeah really quite nice. Uh, let's just look at these trails. So there's your two white ones so you've got a few there. There's color 22 and 21. Okay, so here are the drills and they all do look like they're vintage or older earthy tone colours. There's a nice range in there. Definitely uh, 23 colours in a small 30 by 30 is quite impressive. Quite happy with that. That's a nice one. So there they are and they're really nice so I'll pop these away and we'll bring out the third kit okay so here is the third kit and there is your regular tool kit and uh -oh. <laughs> oh no I thought our days of these ones was long behind us oh no so this one here is uh in the old format of packing which is a lot of little packages and a lot of wastage and so I don't know if this uh, kit is older but it did come up in the new releases so I'm dreading to think that they're starting to go back to this format on some of them um, I'm not going to get the drills out and show you your if you've watched my channel for a while you know my feelings on these packages I hate it and I really wish manufacturers would just lose the idea altogether and go to either those silverback packages or the individual bags so that's a big bummer because there's no details if you don't write on that instantly you absolutely have no clue what that belongs to so a big down on that one but here is the image and the image is gorgeous. I cannot fault the image and I cannot fault the stickiness of the canvas and the clarity that it's printed. Again, 20 colors on this one, uh, which is, you know, a, a nice range of colors. Just really disappointed in the packaging of the drills, but the canvas itself, I really like it it's a really pretty image you will need a light pad i would say because the 310 areas are a bit dark to see but it's printed really well i can't fault that at all but as i said we won't check out the drills uh because they're in that sort of icky packaging <laughs> the the packaging that makes sally have a bad mood all right let's bring out the last one which does not have flowers. Oh, I've already seen the drills and I'm relieved. <laughs> so this one, check it out. There is your uh, standard toolkit. And the drills on this one, thank goodness, are in the nice packaging. I won't get these ones out because we know by now that the silver stripe ones are always really good quality and it's also nicely packaged. So it looks like there's 25 colors in this little 30 by 30. So let's see what it is. And it's this really cute little cat with bubbles. Isn't it gorgeous? 25 colors that's a lot of colors in this one and it's a little tiny bit of white not a lot of white in the background I can tell that's so sticky I don't know if you can see how shiny the glue is on the surface of the canvas there it's really cute really adorable little cat with bubbles that was the last of the kits let me bring them all back in so here they all are, the four awesome kits that I was kindly gifted by DIY Digital Art. So again, a really big thank you to them for these pieces. I absolutely love them all. The canvases are great. They're super sticky. The images are super clear. And the drills look good quality, uh, minus that set that came through in the old-fashioned mini bags. Um, I really, really hope that we're not 
going back towards that again because uh, that is just a horrible way of packing bags but or drills I should say but yeah apart from that all really great recommend them all so I'm really happy let me know down below in the comments what you thought of these kits which is your favorite I love to hear from you and I always respond. Thank you for watching this far. If this is your first time stumbling across my channel, please consider subscribing. That would be awesome. And if everyone could hit that like button and the notification bell. If you're interested in supporting my channel further, I do have a Ko-fi and a Patreon account set up and the details are up here on screen. I am working on some stuff behind the scenes so Patreon will be getting an overhaul for the better in the coming months. Just not quite ready to uh, release everything yet but there are good things coming on the way. So now would be a good time to get on board with Patreon if you wish. But that will do it for this video so everybody no matter where you are please stay safe, stay weird and I'll catch you in the next one.